The second jQuery UI interface is exactly the same as the sortable connect with interface we've just done, except it demonstrates that you can use the same syntax on more than two lists. We've got three lists this time showing levels of stock of car parts, and we can drag items from any list to any other list, and the database is updated accordingly. We can go through this project extremely quickly as the principle's exactly the same as we did before. Don't bother to type anything in this time, just copy all the files from the relevant folder in the working files. Here in connect with multiple.php are the three lists, using new methods working on the display object, named lots, enough and none, three stock levels. I've added these three methods to the display class in classes.php, and these three methods return data from the table parts in the database. What we're primarily interested in is the new jQuery script connect with multiple.js. This time we have three sortable clauses, and in each one the connect with clause connects not just with one list, but two. We do this very simply by using a comma separated list of ID selectors in the connect with clause. This then sets the value of the variable ID just as before and gets the value for quantity from this.id, this being the receiving UL. The Ajax call files the PHP file connect with multiple.ajax.php. And this uses a prepared statement and name parameters to update the quantity field in the parts table in the same way as before. Again, you can see this project in action on the live demo site, and the link is in the lesson text.